for today, let's look at this question regarding minimum value. Suppose A, B, C are positive, we ask to find the minimum value of the following expression, which is A plus 1Q over B plus B plus 1Q over C plus C plus 1Q over A. Please have a good try before you look at the answer. Now, with our law for generality, we let A is greater than or equal to B, which is greater than or equal to C, and which is positive. Now we know that A plus 1 will be greater than or equal to B plus 1, will be greater than or equal to C plus 1, and it is at least 1. This will mean that A plus 1 power 3 will be greater than or equal to B plus 1 power 3, greater than equals to c plus 1 power 3. And the relation of the reciprocal will be 1 over a less than or equals to 1 over b less than or equals to 1 over c. Now we let j to be the given expression. Then we know that by rearrangement argument, This would be at least a plus 1 cube over a plus b plus 1 cube over b plus c plus 1 cube over c. Now we consider a plus 1 cube over a. This is a power 3 plus 3a square plus 3a plus 1 over a and this will equals to a square plus 3a plus 3 plus 1 over a now before we proceed maybe we can check the answer from Wolfram alpha what will be the minimum value of j so we go to the page and we ask the machine to get us the value And it turns out that the minimum value will be equal to 81 over 4. And it happens when A equals to B equals to C equals to half. And this gives us a good idea of what to proceed. Let's continue on our question here. So this is what we have just now. And we know that the minimum value will happen when A equals to 1 over 2. So with this in mind, we write this expression as a squared plus 3a plus 1 over a plus 3. And do a little bit of modification, a squared as a squared. And this is 3a over 6 times 6. And this is 1 over a over 8 times 8 and plus 3. Now, using the AMG inequality on these 15 terms. One term from A square, six terms from 3A over 6, and eight terms from 1 over A over 8. Using AMG inequality, this is greater than or equal to 15. And the multiplication for everything here to the power of 1 over 15. Uh, copy plus 2. So this will be a square times, this is 3a over 6, is actually a over 2, and to the power of 6, and this is 1 over 8a to the power of 8. Now, if we look at the power of a, the power of a should be 2 plus 6 minus 8, and which is equal to 0. And for the number, it is 1 over 2 to the power of 6, times 1 over 8 to the power of 8. The whole thing to the power of 1 over 15 and plus 3. Now using a bit of calculation, we know that this is 1 over 2 to the power of 6 and this is 1 over 2 to the power of 24. All together is 1 over 2 to the power of 30. Raised to the power of 1 over 15, so it will be 1 over 2 square. And therefore, this is 15 over 4 
plus 3. And therefore, this is 27 over 4. With the equality holds, if and only if a squared equals to a over 2 equals to 1 over 8a and equals to 1 over 4, which means that a has to be equals to a half. This result agree with what we have just now from u from alpha. Okay, let's go back to the question here. So we know that this will be at least 27 over 4. And therefore, j will be at least 27 over 4 times 3, which means that this is 81 over 4. With the equality holds, if and only if, a equals to b equals to c equals to 1 over 2. This is my method using the rearrangement argument and AMGM inequality. If you have any different solution, please write it in the comment. That's all for today's lesson. I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.